Well, uh, this is a pretty standard uh, black lighting sheet uh, setup here. Uh, I'm a beetle collector, so this is the way I do it when I'm out collecting for beetles. Uh, something that beetle collectors do that a lot of other people who run lights don't do is they put a ground cloth down here. I've got a separate sheet laying down on the ground and another sheet suspended. Uh, I like to use black light and mercury vapor light together. That's something else that beetle collectors do. Uh, beyond that, it's pretty much sight selection, uh, trying to put your lights right where the beetles are that you're interested in looking for. And uh, I'm in a little oak mott here. Uh, it's springtime. It doesn't have a complete canopy yet. And uh, as the insects are coming up this evening, once it gets dark, they start emerging out of this litter and all this dead wood and stuff that's around here. And your light will be right there to intercept them as they start flying. So this should be, a, this should be an excellent setup. Basically, you want your lights to be running at dusk, especially if you're looking for beetles. Uh, a lot of beetles will be flying as soon as the sun sets, maybe even before the sun sets, like right about now. So uh, we'll get these lights cranked up here in a few minutes. Uh, it's a nice, good, warm night. That's the best. Uh, we've got a little bit of a breeze tonight. That's not particularly good. A breeze will take out a lot of insects and uh, prevent them from flying very far. Also, uh, mess up your sheet when you don't have it tacked down properly. Generally, for beetle collecting, uh, most beetles are active right after dusk when it's warm. As soon as it starts cooling down through the course of the evening, there'll be less beetle activity. But that's not true of all insect activity. Uh, certain moths, for example, tend to fly a lot when it's, when it's late. In fact, some moths won't fly until certain late hours of the night and uh, many of those are adapted much better to fly in the cooler times. Of course, in the hot summertime, it's warm all night long, things are moving all night long, but in the spring, when you're after beetles, you kind of got to catch, catch it the first few hours of darkness being the best. I run this system on a small generator. I'll come out, I'll set up for two or three hours, pretty much take it down after that and, and pack it in. Uh, I like to just, my system is set up so I can set it up pretty quickly and, and take it down and pack it up and move on to the next site with a minimum, uh, minimum of hassle.